A 330 acre plot of land has changed Southwest Atlanta and is shaping the TV and movie industry. One year ago today, Tyler Perry made history with the grand opening of his studio. Today, he said thank you to all of the legends who've paved the way for all of the dreamers out there. Tyler Perry Studios is between downtown Atlanta and the airport, and that red carpet event he had a year ago welcomed a long list of names like Oprah Winfrey, Will Smith, Beyonce, Harry Belafonte, and the late Congressman John Lewis, who was there as well. Tyler Perry dedicated sound stages to actors, directors, civil rights icons that paved the way for him and says he hopes his studios will pave the way for others. Perry made history as the first studio fully owned by an African American. He helped cement Atlanta as a major player in the entertainment industry. Perry bought the land for $30 million in 2015. It used to be Fort McPherson's Army base. The structures used for military housing at one point are now used by cast and crew. They created a COVID bubble to get production back going over the summer during the pandemic. Tyler Perry said in an interview that bigger things are still ahead and he plans to build out the studio in more phases. He's also been so generous to help the community, often anonymously.